numbers that we usually don't don't do. Um, I'm not sure what it was, but all of us, uh, including myself, just weren't there. And uh, but credit to them that they're, they're a really good team, and uh, they hit they hit some really big shots. Did you see similarities to the last time you played them down at Auburn and the, the way the game played out? Um, I think that they're they're a really good uh, three point shooting team, and I think that showed tonight. You know, they take a lot of threes, and uh, I feel like they make a lot too. So I feel like that does something similar between the games. What role, if any, do you think fatigue uh, might have played playing three straight days? Um, it, I think, I mean, yes, but what we should be um, in, in top condition to, pl to come play this game. Um, but three games in three days is, is hard and uh, something that we won't have to do the rest of the season. Um, so we just got to learn from this and, and get better. Is that fatigue maybe more mental and emotional than even physically? Like, if, can you feel okay, but then, you know, maybe not be as sharp mentally or emotionally during a game? I, I think that's, uh, that's easy to do, especially with the crowd and with the atmosphere, you know, just your, your mind and your emotions being really hyped up, but then uh, your body just not being there. What about the potential of a, of a letdown coming off of the Kentucky game? So much emotion. You guys played so well on such a big stage. Do you think that might have played a role in it at all? Um, I'm not sure. I mean, we were we were really focused on Kentucky and we were really focused on the Auburn. We just didn't get the job done. What was Coach Barnes's message at the half with you guys? Uh, you know, at least being within striking range at that point. Um, I mean, that they were making runs and we, and we knew we were going to make runs, and uh, we just had to keep fighting. What about after the game? What did Coach Barnes tell you? Um, I mean, we're all obviously disappointed. But uh, we have a, a bigger tournament coming up, and uh, we just got to get ready for that. Um, talk about um, you know the seniors that didn't get a chance to finish their careers with an SEC tournament title. You must you know obviously feel a lot for them. Oh yeah, um, I mean I can't imagine how they're feeling. You know, putting in all the work and then just coming up do you, short. Do you think those things, you know, like missing out on that and being so close? Can give you extra motivation for the NC tournament? Uh, I think it can. Yeah. Job, appreciate it. Yeah.